The two remaining Americans who had been held in North Korea have been released and are on their way home. Well, I think uh, it's a wonderful day for them and their families. Obviously, we're very grateful uh, for their safe return. And uh, I appreciate uh, Director Clapper uh, doing a great job uh, on uh, what was uh, obviously a challenging mission. Director of National Intelligence James Clapper, who was sent to North Korea as a presidential envoy, was accompanying Americans Kenneth Bay and Matthew Miller on their journey back to the U.S. Clapper is apparently the highest ranking administration official to visit Pyongyang. Officials refuse to provide any other details about the release of Bay and Miller or their return to the U.S. Miller, who's from California, was serving a six-year jail term on charges of espionage after he allegedly ripped his tourist visa at Pyongyang's airport in April and demanded asylum. Meanwhile, Bay, who's from Washington state, is a Korean-American missionary and was serving a 15-year sentence for alleged anti-government activities. Bay and Miller were the last Americans held by North Korea following the release last month of Jeffrey Fowle. Matthew Burgoyne, Associated Press.